add and simplify the two expressions here, the two rational expressions. So I put the negative sign in red out in front of the first expression so that we can see that it's important to note that it needs to be distributed through the entire piece that we have. So that numerator, since the negative is out in front of the fraction, is indicated to be out in front of the entire fraction and needs to be distributed along in the numerator. So, in the first stage we would have negative 7x and then minus a negative would be plus a 3y and then we're going to add 2x and then we're going to subtract 9y and the reason I can just combine these like normal is because of the denominators both being 8x means that these are common denominators so I can just leave the denominator as 8x. Now we need to combine some like terms and I can see that there's a negative 7x here plus a 2x here. Negative 7 and positive 2 are enemies so it looks like negative 5x is going to come out of this winning negative 7 plus 2 and on the other hand we have a positive 3y that's being subtracted by 9y. 3 minus 9 is negative 6 so this would indicate we'd have a minus 6y. This is of course all over 8x and there's no more simplification that can occur so we are done with this particular problem. So pause the video and see if you can do this one on your own. Again, I put the negative sign out in front so you can practice your distributive property. So assuming you took a second out and practiced and tried to do this on your own, or attempted to do it on your own, I should say, let's take the negative sign and distribute through so that we get negative z minus a negative would be plus 11a, and then we're adding on a 7z, and we're subtracting a 4a. And since the two denominators are the same, this is all over 2z. I didn't need to worry about common denominators because the denominators were already the same. Now, negative z plus 7z is going to give us 6z. And on the other hand, 11a's minusing 4a's will leave us with a plus 7a. After we put all this over the old denominator of 2z, we are done with the problem.